My name is Joe Scully. I'm the president of the Motor Transport Association of Connecticut, representing small business trucking companies in the state. We sat down with some of our members to learn about the costs and negative impacts that tolls would have on their business. My name is Sandy Clark. I'm from Smart Choice Trucking. We're based out of East Hartford. Hi, my name is Mike Payne. Uh, the name of our company is Payne's Incorporated. Uh, many people know us more as Payne's Recycling and Rubbish Removal. Uh, we're located in East Granby, Connecticut. Uh, Mike DeGrand. I work for John DeGrand and Son Incorporated. We're based in West Haven, Connecticut. Katie Childs. I'm with Texas Source Fuel and J Vitale Transportation out of Meriden, Connecticut. Uh, my name is John Pernicki. Um, I am from Coastal Carriers of Connecticut. We're located in Ansonia, Connecticut. My name is John Titsworth. Uh, I work for UPS. Uh, out of Hartford, Connecticut. Uh, my name is Herb Holden. I'm with Herb Holden Trucking, a family corporation that started in 1961 in East Windsor, Connecticut. My name is Axel Carrion. I work for United Parcel Service. Our Connecticut headquarters is based out of Hartford, Connecticut. My name is Andy Anastasio Jr. I'm the CEO for Anastasio and Sons Trucking Company based in New Haven, Connecticut. The increase in expenses would come somewhere around $40,000 for us. Uh, I'm going to estimate that it's probably in excess of $200,000 a year. Yeah, we estimate the tolls will cost about uh, $55,000 to our business. I estimate that driving approximately 2 million miles a year would somewhere between $400,000 and $500,000 a year. It could cost us, based on our mileage, um, somewhere between two dollars and $300,000. A year. It would be a significant cost to our business. Uh, we would obviously monitor what the final proposals would be uh, to see what our overall impact would be. This would add over $100,000 a year expense to my company. At a quick glance, uh, it would cost anywhere from a quarter of a million dollars to 350000 depending on whether it's on peak or off peak, and that's at the lowest rate. This would cost millions of dollars. These are just a few of the small business trucking company owners in Connecticut. If you would like to hear more from them and learn about other solutions, contact the MTAC office and we would be happy to help.